Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to be showing you step by step how to install the DecoCraft mod for Minecraft 1.12.2. This will only work for the Java edition of the game, so make sure you have the Java edition available, not the Bedrock edition. First thing you want to do is open up your internet and type DecoCraft mod. Oops, mod. Curse Forge. Are right, you going to go to Files and 1.12.2 will be right here. You want to download that. This mod will need a um, dependency, so type PCR model library 1.12.2. Curse Forge. Files here. You can keep the file because it's not malicious. We go to Files. 1.12.2. Alright, you can keep it. Next, you want to head over to files.minecraftforge.net. 1.12.2. Latest release. Don't click anything on Add Focus because it's usually um, not safe. Alright, you want to skip. Keep Forge. Alright, once your files are all downloaded, you want to drag them all to your desktop. Open up your Minecraft launcher. Alright, you want to have normal Minecraft 1.12.2 installed and you want to run normal Minecraft. Alright, once Minecraft 1.12.2 Classic is up, you want to hit Quit Game. You want to hit Windows R, Navigate 2%, App Data Percent, hit OK, dot Minecraft. You want to have a Mods folder for this, so just create one. Take all your other mods, drag them out. Alright, you want to throw your mods in here. And I'm also going to get another mod, Optifine. I highly recommend getting this mod. All these links will be in the description if you need them. I'm just going to get Optifine quick. Optifine specializes in performance for video game enhancement. As in like, it'll improve your Minecraft performance. Alright. So we already ran normal Minecraft. Now you want to run Forge 1.12.2. You want to install the client. Once your client is installed, you want to run Minecraft. Whoops. You can throw it away. Once your client is installed, you want to open Minecraft. 
Alright, you should see Forge right here now. If you don't, click Installations, New Installation. Scroll down until you see Release 1.12 Forge. Alright, now we're going to customize our installation. And I'm going to give it a icon. Alright, once you hit play, it will need to download first. Forge usually needs to do that. Download the files required, and then it will run. Alright. Just a heads up, the mod I'm using in this video is DecoCraft, I've used it for a very long time, it is a very huge mod, and you're going to need to allocate some, maybe more RAM than you usually do, because the mod is huge, and it eats a lot of um, your computer's memory up, and it might take a while to load in too, because there's a lot of models in the mod, chairs, tables, furniture, etc. Right. Once you're in Minecraft Forge 1.12.2, you will see a new section mods with DecoCraft. All right. Now we're going to open up a world. Throw this up here. Taking a while today. All right. Let me go to full screen. Once you're in your Minecraft world, everything will appear the same. Trees, grass, your inventory, except you'll have new pages with props, food, holiday, kitchen, market, trophies, yard supplies, storage, technology, like an old TV. Oh, look at that. It's like something my grandma would use. Um, washer. Some of the stuff is decoration, but some of it I believe you can use, like barrels. They can be used. Alright. Get rid of the world. Alright. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it taught you something. I hope you learned how to install the mod correctly. If it didn't work for you, please leave comments down below and I'll see what I can do to um, teach you how to fix that. Alright? Um, Trigon's eye out. See ya. Easy go.